and I'm talking about a big team fight sort of situation. Salt can just pick off Naga very easily, but in a team fight situation, tools that are kind of in play now kind of complement their playstyle more, or is it less with 6.86? I mean, remember we got to see a lot of, well, a Ravage coming out here for Planum, but he's still going to get caught up. Sunstrike, got him! Beautifully done, then Weeha is going to set up the foot for himself. Soul Siphon return here for the Naga, but Naga is going to be able to slither away from trouble, it looks like, and Misery is going to be the gatekeeper and keep him away from the pressure. Secret off to a hot start, and oh, speaking of hot, old 11 here, dishing out some fire auto attacks onto the back end here of Mr. Envy. Can he get close enough? No, he's going to be going down. Oh, double kills for Secret right now. A hard commitment comes out from the bat, hoping to deal with a spirit siphon into the into a pounce, but it just just not enough bodies there at the start. They, I think they really want to bounce back here. Pounce will connect. They move in, they're waiting for the follow-up stun from Lanham here. They'll get it, but looking to interject is going to be Puppy who gets a big Riptide off. They are going to be able to get the grab onto Tidehunter, and it looks like uh, Night Soccer will be able to make it away in the back end of a Tango, but oh, big Riptide damage onto Lanham, but Lanham confident and strong stays, gets off Impale, and they might be able to also bring down Puppy. It looks like they will, and they even preserve the last hit. It looks like for the Night Soccer, Kaka could be picking up that one. Sunstrike? Oh, it got him, but not enough to bring him down. Just enough regen coming in for Lanham. And Everyone died in neutral. <laughs> and now we all will bow before the mighty centaur god who will bat us in the head. <laughs> and Lanham's like, for that, that looks fun. I'm going to do that too. Uh, the lions got him. Two up. That's easy. E way easier to kill them. Everybody all. died in the neutrals. Let's go. <laughs> well, that's, dude. that's great for Eo, man. Because that, that looked like a catastrophic kind of a start there. But, uh, hey, they're scrappy, they're able to put it together, well, Pi, after all. They're a high-risk, high-reward team, that's why I like watching them play. So, the question I was alluding to earlier, and as maybe I have to hold out again, mid lane, a trade between the two is Puppy, very happy to hard commit, does not care about no Scython, will be able to take him down. The return fire, though, is they get Wii on the backside, now they move in, suddenly a wild pilot eye appears after the death, and now they're gonna get a good Maledic, a good ensnare. There's the forward right clicks, and there's the kill. Back and forth we go. This game much more action packed. I think we had maybe one kill by this point last time. So, and there's more options available in this patch. Mm -hmm. So here they are, go fighting forward. some more mid lane. Weeha does take the best route to make it away, but it doesn't really matter. There is just too many swarming on in. They get the stun. Hey, okay, gets a cold snap, but death profit snap. <laughs> oh, we know. Eleven still always just seems to find his way, man. He is about to be level six. Uh, a little after four minutes. My goodness, it's a good lane. And again, Weehan in trouble. Ehom quick to try to punish him, but this time they have the response. And they're going to be able to take on the Death Prophet, but that means that they can make a full commitment into this bottom lane diving beyond the tower right now. They're going to go for Envy, and they're going to get him. Stunt. And then the follow-up possibly coming out. They're going to also take down Pylite Eye. Mm. They will lose their Night Soccer in the end, but... Where's my Centaur when I need him? <laughs> but Lanham is a Gunslinger. <laughs> Could have been a killing spree for the Centaur, but he was not present for this fight, unfortunately. But a big <laughs> successful push they're having for, for Ehome, right? I gotta say. Oh, bottom lane. Look at this. Puppy going to work right now. They are going to get the catch with a helpful cast bounce right there in 11. Uh, the Maldix uh, stun continue to tick on through. They've lost the Naga, and 11 is going to drop there in the end. Oof. I wasn't sure what level that Maldix was. If it was that was really close. He almost had a stick close. up. It's only one. That three three charge stick would have our timing. And he's already committed the fight here. He's burning it down. Puppy is sweeping in. The ensnare. It will swing. It will catch. I like that. Look at fall with the casket. And go ahead and get the sun strike. Hey, mission. Game How do you accomplish? Down by the by the ember, she can't get up and and like up close and personal because of Tidehunter too. So like there's a lot of stuff that snare from downtown. Follow up sunstrike, even a ravish committed all in here for the night stalker. Much of a response to stop her from getting it. So that's a good grab for her. Oh wait, or maybe not. Suddenly a wild pilot eye appears. Gets the Maldig off at board, and Old Chicken wants to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Soul Siphon, man. He just wrecks the Witch Doctor. Drops one of the Misery. Misery has to turn away. And, well, he just pile yeah. Okay, looks like bots are going to be coming, though. Oh. Oh, bottom lane. Bats seeing if he can get a kill here without having to commit the lasso. It does force out the sleep. Is he going to blink and try to catch up with Misery here with a Flame Break, maybe? He's pursuing. Nope, no Flame Break. Oh, no. Okay, one's dead. We'll get the grab on the puppy. Pull them back, and I think Secret might have to let their captain fall here. 
Or not. Misery looking to re-engage. Naga does yeah, go he, down. Yeah, he's, he's gonna get fingered though if it goes too close. Like, carry it, or Crypt Swarm to the finger, he's dead. So yeah. he can't go in. Mm, I'm surprised. This is serious money here. This is the this is a good time. Ooh. You guys, bots. As uh, the Shadow Blade came online, and uh oh, they found a wild Weeha. Lead in. Hex stun. Here's there, but not necessary. Neither is the lasso. Okay, finally he's like, okay, he healed up. Let's just finger him down. We all will be dropped, but look at this. They're gonna get a response. Nice Ravage from Misery will intercept. They get the grab onto 11 as Lanham's also on the way out. But here comes Death Prophet committing the exorcism, right? Can old chicken make it dark? And he goes right into his island and right into trouble. All that exorcism damage plus the siphon. And Ember doesn't stand a chance. Boots travel great for uh momentum and moving around, but not great for keeping you alive, unfortunately. Yikes, second ravage Radiant. with a Slark who has a uh, who has um, Shadow, Blade. Shadow Blade? Yeah, nowhere it's is safe. Such a terrible You thing. have to, like, buddy-buddy up. Like, hey, you mind if I just kind of follow you around for a not, while? Not only that, you just have to buy a ton of sentries. Oh. Condolences to Envy. He got him and Slark. Still have a tiny and bit left on oh. the daytime. While they're making it go in top lane, Old Eleven's like, you guys move in. I found myself a little pile I die here. They're gonna get the kill on that. And they can't even get the Death Prophet down. She's like, bring it on, baby. You don't got the Witch Doctor. Moves forward with the Soul Siphon, but now it might be too much. Puppy moves in. Eyes bigger than stomach, unfortunately, at that moment there for the Death Prophet. She will go down, but it's a two for one trade. Big comeback games on the back of a, you know, solo Ember Spirit Arteezy. Rapiers in hand, but this game he's not getting that kind of far mid lane. Poor little pie gonna be taken away from his flank again this time. Oh, he's fingered. He's down. Dang. Yeah, the range is pretty damn ridiculous at that point. Oh my god, look at the items just flow in. King Bro Strike there. <laughs> it's pretty damn crazy. Radiance bottom tower has fallen. Alright. No sun strike this time yet. Kaka as he's locked down. There's a bit of force coming out. This is taking he's still running. Yeah, this is uh Run away. Run away. That Agnum Scepter Where, so much where is this guy? Oop, not good gem. Uh oh. Somebody's about to get picked off. Uh oh. Oh! He sees Invoker, he goes for the pole misery, he's not going. Oh no! Misery! He's not gonna be able to get the Ravage or the Blink off to go in, and it's a swing and a miss here. Oh no, here comes Eho now. They take down the Invoker, step back, blink. I, I, I don't know. No radiance burn. He's going in. And uh, hey, suddenly fans in the game. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> just pie. Oh, come on, that's not just a pie after all. Your two goes down the top. He just. Dyer's bottom tower is hmm. under attack. Well, they'll get their tower. Here's secret inside the high ground. Early hex. Tornado. Nicely done from Wii. But they are going to get the lasso off, but it's quickly shaken off right now. And the bump forward here for Flame Break. They still continue to move in. Ravage right in the midst of it to try to slow them down, but the BKP is able to kind of force away the stun. Miser going for a TP. They don't have a way to stop him. It looks like Void. Not at the ready. Because the team was like, okay, we're pushing now. Yeah. This game, he's given a lot more autonomy and using it to farm. Oh, hello. How do they uh, stop the blink dagger, though? Uh, oh, like that. Quick draw, McGraw coming out here from 11. Pulls him right back into trouble, right into a silence. I don't think they have the manpower to take him down. Another silence, man. A lot of hate to stop him. Is it still going to be enough? It will be. Woo! That was like a mini ballet right there. That was nice. Uh oh, on the other side, death work committed here from Mr. Pi as he goes under the shadow Stand amulet. In there! And some are fighting right now, but Lanham's the one in trouble. Weeha, the magician, not gonna be able to catch him. A good blink away. He's gone. Oh, well, that that's too much fight for me. Well, maybe he has taken after CCY. Oh, oh short. can he kidnap that guy? Oh, Eleven has lasso here. Kidnap. I'm out that door, I'm gonna get you. Again, quick pullback. The Yule could be there, slows him down, but that's not coming. Pick up the gem. I'm down. Now I'm gonna the song anyways, but as they go in, they break out the fight. Misery commits his ravage. He ends up going down as well. Fans in! Naga with the oh, buyback. Wait, no. Naga gets her jet back, it looks like. How do they not get him out of that? Oh, okay. Good ice wall, maybe. It seems like they go and four is, of course, out the PKP, so. Okay. Something. Deward that. Nice. Okay, fan, this is your chance oh, to you go it. somewhere else. While well, Lanham's like, fan, up here, fool! They are gonna move in now, they're gonna get the pounce of the finger, and. <laughs> up here, fool? That was much more on Lanham, but hey, fan was there to get off the pounce and some right clicks, so. He's got a lane, and we Wait, see. Fan doesn't have a TP, though. How is he gonna get through this fight? He's not. He's got a bounty rune down there, he's gonna probably go for and just farm that. 
bit. See how they off the illusion, but look at this top. They make another move for uh, Death Prophet here, but she's moving in. Yule. Ravage out. And a lot of ults. They got the Yules. He hopes on route from behind, but it's taking too long. Now Death Prophet goes down, but they're going to fight here. There you go. You just wasted all of those magical spells. So we're going to go ahead and take you apart here. Anyhow tries to TP, but it quickly hexed up. And here comes the Bat Rider. 11's going to be moving and taking fight. They finish off We They scout out a little pie. They take down. And all three go down and. Fan almost gets there. And Fan is here for trouble. He takes down with the help of this mighty exorcism. Now they're going for the next Don't be scared, Fan. He's like, I'm in it. I'm going. Let's see. What's Secret going to do? They're going to get pie caught. And this could be the end of their death ward. Unless he has a buyback. He's out. No buyback. Song already used. It's not for a setup here. Secret have to make do with what they got. And it could be a, a Ravage follow-up invoker combo. Here it is. There's the big Ravage. And it'll be enough to take down Lanham. He quickly buys back. He's got boost to travel. He's looking to come in and end this game out. There is the secondary lasso grab. Onto the mighty Weeha, we'll pull right back into the action. Fan. The Yule's gonna throw him up. Where's Fana? He's going in, he gets a nice Abyssal lockdown onto Invoker. That's he is rapier. going to be out. Is this it here? It's rapier in hand, can Envy do it? Oh, big damage through with the Slide of Fist is gonna be forcing Kaka back, but Fan. Fan's going in! He's going in, he's got Misery down. And they're looking to walk away. Envy. Oh, he has to be careful, he can get hacked. Oh, we got him up. Did he not know Lanham bought back? I don't know, but. Yeah, he got caught out, taken down. That's a rave for the deck, and that could Man. just be the game. Man, Man has done it. it. Yeah, Fan. Woo! E-Home have done it. 30 to 17 is going to be your close out score. Shadowblade because of Blink Batrider and the Night Stalker Ags. I mean, when you're.